Auntie King is here to read with you every day. Something new. Grab a book, turn a page. Reading is fun. nephews it's your favorite auntie auntie kenya thank you for joining me again today so that we can read another amazing story hmm what will we read have you ever heard the story of the three little pigs do you want to read that yeah i think that's it we'll read the three little pigs but first let's build our vocabulary with the word of the day It's time for the word of the day. The word of the day is house. How many times can you spot the word house in the story? The Three Little Pigs by James Hallowell Phillips. Once upon a time, there was a mother pig with three little pigs. She had not enough to keep them, so she sent them out into the world to see their fortune. The first pig went off and met a man with a bundle of straw and said to him, Please, man, give me that straw to build me a house. The man did, and the little pig built a house with it. Along came a wolf and knocked at the door and said, Little pig, little pig, let me come in. The pig answered, No, not by the hair of my chinny chin chin. Then I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house in, said the wolf. So he huffed and he puffed and he blew the house in. The little pig ran away. The second pig met a man with a bundle of sticks and said, Please, man, give me those sticks to build a house. The man did, and the pig built his house. Along came the wolf and said, Little pig, little pig, let me come in. No, no, not by the hair of my chinny chin chin. Then I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house down. So he huffed and he puffed and he puffed and he huffed. And at last he blew the house down. The second little pig ran away. The third little pig met a man with a load of bricks and said, Please, man, give me those bricks to build a house with. The man gave him the bricks and he built his house with them. Along came the wolf, as he did with the other little pigs, and said, Little pig, little pig, let me come in. No, no, not by the hair of my chinny chin chin. Then I'll huff. And I'll puff and I'll blow your house in. So he huffed and he puffed and he huffed and he puffed and he puffed and he huffed. But he could not blow the house down. The wolf sees all three pigs are in the house. He becomes very angry and decided to enter the house through the chimney. The last little pig lit the fireplace and put on a pot of water. The wolf felt the smoke coming out of the fireplace and said, I'm no fool. Those pigs mean business. He knew they were not worth it and ran away. And the three little pigs never had to worry about the wolf again. The End The word of the day is house. How many times did you spot the word house in the story? If you said 14, you are absolutely correct. The word house was in the story 14 times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 14 times, yay! 
nieces and nephews. Thank you again for reading with me. As always, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Until next time, keep reading.